Welcome to Sammy's School of Sweets, where we learn about things with sugar and candy because everything is better with candy. I love candy. Let's get started. Today we're talking about mitosis, and mitosis is not an ugly toe fungus. No, it is actually when one cell splits into two cells, which we call daughter cells. It basically clones itself so that、um, there's someone to inherit the world when they're gone. You understand? Okay, let's start. Okay, so the first phase of mitosis is called interphase, and that's appropriately named because it is the phase where they're in between mitosis. So, like inter, like in between、uh, episodes of mitosis. So during interphase, all a cell does really is do its normal stuff, you know, minding its own business, doing its job. Inside the nucleus, there are these tangled bundles of DNA strands, and they're called chromatin. During interphase, the cell replicates this bundle of chromatin so that there are two of them inside the nucleus, which later one of them will be given to the new、um, daughter cell. Not only do chromatin double, but also these things called centrosomes. And these centrosomes, what they do is they basically regulate this process, and they look like、uh, star tubey things. Our next phase is called prophase, and during this phase,、uh, we make some chromosomes. So that's cool and exciting. So basically, what happens is, you recall that chromatin, the bundles,、uh, they're full of strands of DNA. And what happens is when the strands of DNA wrap around proteins, they create these things called chromatids. We're going to simplify these strands into gummy worms because it'll make it a lot easier. And there are a lot more than three chromosomes. There are actually twenty-three pairs. When the original chromatid and its copy attach to themselves, they're called chromosomes. In the center of this chromosomes. There are these things called centromeres,、uh, which we'll use later. So then the nuclear envelope disintegrates, and centrosomes go to opposite ends of the cell. And as they do that, centrosomes create these things called spindle fibers, and sometimes they're called microtubules. Next, the cell goes through a phase called metaphase, which in Greek means afterphase. During this phase, the chromosomes Move themselves along the equator of the cell. Chromosome centromeres attach themselves to spindle fibers by using motor proteins, and there are four on each centromere, two on each side. Motor proteins make sure chromosomes align themselves in the exact center of the cell by pulling on the spindle fiber ropes. There's also another type of protein. It's called dynein. And it's along the cell membrane and pulls on the spindle fibers from near the end of the cell. We'll just take out the lifesavers for simplicity's sake. The next phase is called anaphase, and it's appropriately named because ana in Greek means back. So what happens during this phase is motor proteins pull harder than ever before and separate the chromatids from their clone. And what this does is it pulls them to the opposite ends of the cell. Next is telophase,、uh, and during telophase, parts of the cell start to be reconstructed. This includes the nuclear membrane and the nucleoli inside. Then, chromatids relax back into their tangled chromatin states. When the cell looks like it has this crease in the middle of it,、uh, it's called cleavage. The last and final phase. Thank goodness, because I want to go eat all this candy. Is called cytokinesis, and it's also appropriately named because, if you recall from physics, kinesis means like movement. All right. So basically, during this phase, what happens is the momentum from anaphase. You know, when the chromatids split, they're still traveling in opposite directions. That causes the cell membrane to. Basically, close in on the middle, and it becomes two different cells, and 
we have our two daughter selves that are exact replicas of each other. So that's it. That's we're done. I just I just take a little bite. That's it. Wait. Well, now that we're done, I'm just gonna. I got a little snack. If you guys don't mind, while we go over under credits. So you can run the credits now. Oh yeah, thanks for watching. I hope I get a good grade on this. This is happening right now. My toast is happening right now.